right now, though, we're getting right about that dinner hour, so uh, I think Adam Clements has something to do with that. Adam, I'm a little envious. Gary, if there's food on the road, I'm going to find it. So I came here to Bar Bill Tavern. It's in East Aurora, so we're just outside of Buffalo. But, of course, you come to a town like this, you got to get the chicken wings. i got a couple left. Don't worry. I'll make quick work of these. There was a beef on wex sandwich right here with some chips. That's gone. I also was introduced to another delicacy that's native to this region, Western New York-style pizza. Take a look. We've likely heard of New York style pizza, but have you heard of Western New York style pizza? Allow me to introduce you. This is unique to Western New York. Yeah. What, why, how? Well, the beef, I don't know, just, uh, I, I think Western New York's the only one that actually sells the cup and char pepperoni. Everybody else just sells standard margarita, which is the disc size uh, yeah, yeah. pepperonis that don't cup and char. And in Western New York, that's just what we do. Well, this is a cup and char. It's got a little spice. I don't know if you've tried it okay. before. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Got a nice kick. Our regular margarita will just cook it just flat. flat. The cup and char literally cups up. You'll see it when you uh, you'll see it when it comes out of the oven. It's all cupped up and, and charred on the edges. Okay. So that's why it gets the name cup and char. The the holy trinity, the beef on weck, the buffalo wings. And the cup and char pizza. And the cup and char believe. pizza, the New York style. Right? Gotta be the thin crispy. Gotta be the New York style. It gives that, that extra kick, that bite, crunch. Beautiful. All right, shall we? Take a little go, bite. Ryan. Yeah. Off. Woo, woo. <laughs> I'm Adam Clements, and I approve this message. <laughs> go Bills. Who <Food> day? Who <laughs> day all day, baby. All right, uh, special thanks to the folks at Mr. Ventry's in Niagara Falls for uh, playing ball with us. And the cup and char pizza, who knew? How about it? It was delicious. As were these wings here uh, at, at Bar Bill. I'm gonna polish these off, but make sure uh, you tune in tonight at 11. We are gonna introduce you to a pair of brothers. One's a Bills fan, one's a Bengals fan. They both grew up in Niagara Falls. We'll see how that whole dynamic works. They have a lot of fun stuff to say coming up on this Sunday's game. Tune in, that's tonight on Local 12 News, live at 11. Until then, happy winging. We'll send it back to you, Paula. Now, so Adam, a little confession here. I was actually born in upstate New York, but I have no idea what WEC, what is WEC? WEC <laughs> yeah. is a, Take your time. you asked me when my mouth is full, Paul. <laughs> WEC is, it's essentially a roll that is cut in half. You put the beef on, the top of that roll has a caraway and sea salt seasoning to it that you apply after applying to some egg wash, and then you put it in the oven, you bake it, and you get this wonderful salty sort of crunch to it uh, that, that goes very well with that beef. Whoa, okay, you took notes. <laughs> that sounds excellent, I must say. All right, thank you, Adam. Tune in to Local 12 tomorrow night at 7 for our hour-long playoff special. We'll also have a preview Sunday morning at 11.30 with Richard Skinner and Chelsea Sig joining Gary and Adam live from Buffalo. We'll also have a playoff post-game report immediately after the conclusion of the CBS coverage Sunday.